after Nianzolo, obviously, a 0-0 draw here at home. Having playing them back to back, did that help them? Yeah, I think it did. I think, um, you know, I think our team, you know, was a little bit off it tonight, which is going to happen. You know, I've just said to them, it's a good sign. They're frustrated. They're upset in the dressing room. You know, that shows they, they care. We haven't lost the game. You know, we've, we've drawn against a very, very good side that were on a good run before before Saturday's game. Um, and, you know, I think it was, was probably a fair point in the end. Um, but what I like about our team is we don't stop. You know, we had some not good chances, but we, we kept trying, we kept pushing for it. And it just one of those nights, it, it wouldn't go in. And they had a few chances as well. It's probably a really exciting game for the neutrals. Um, but listen, we, I think the whole club's a bit gutted and frustrated, but it's good signs. We're in a good position. We need to be positive. We need the crowd to be fully behind us on Saturday and we go again. So the first half was not as good as the second half. Yeah. What were those words like at half time? Yeah, I mean, we wanted a fast start. We went aggressive with the with the lineup. Um, you know, picked a very front foot attacking team. And tonight, you know, we started slow for whatever reason. I don't know. Maybe we was a bit leggy from from Saturday. You know, in terms of the journey, maybe it took it out of them. But um, yeah, we started a bit slow. And then I felt that we got better as the half went on. Created some good chances. And then in the second half, it was a bit bitty. It was a bit, you know, end to end football. I feel any team, you know, they could have nicked it as well. So I'm glad we just didn't lose it. I feel when, we, when we're, you know, not playing as well, we still get a point. It's a good sign. So mentioning that lineup, obviously there was quite a few changes from Saturday. Yeah. Was there any reason to that? Yeah, I just felt that when you play a team Saturday and then Tuesday, which is, you know, unheard of really, I felt that they, they you know, tactically might have known exactly how we were playing and personnel. So I just wanted to freshen it up. We've got a very, very good squad with good players. So I felt confident with the, with the change. Um, when, you, when you're a manager, it's not always going to work. So, you know, I can hold my hand up to that. Maybe it didn't work tonight, but listen, we didn't lose the game. So it's a value, val valuable point for this, for this football team. And we go against a big, big, you know, game on Saturday. So coming into today's game, it was 13 games unbeaten. Yeah. Was there a bit of pressure around the club for that? Yeah, there should be pressure on our team. We're in a really good position. We've got to enjoy that pressure. You know, it's pressure on my shoulders, the players' shoulders. And uh, we've got to embrace that. You know, I'm hoping that, you know, going back to the Chelmsford game at home when this place was packed out, you know, we need to learn from them experiences. When there's a big crowd, it's the time, time to turn it on and really embrace it. So these experiences are always going to help us, you know. A little bit of a negative feel in our dressing room. I said to them, just keep, keep working, keep, you know, trying to get these points on the board. Um, there weren't many games in our league today, so it's a point added to our total. Uh, and we just keep working hard, keep sticking together, good spirit, and we go again. And obviously, speaking of Saturday's game against top of the league, yeah, possibly the hardest game so far this season. How are you going to prepare for that? Prepare like we all, always do. For me, this was I knew this was going to be tough. The way their manager sets them up, they work, they run hard. Um, there's no easy games in this league. You look at our results and, you know, 1-0 here's and 2-1, all the games are really, really tight. Uh, I heard tonight that Welling drew with, with Hampton. Um, it's a tough, tough league and sometimes there's strange results, bottom teams beating the top team. So we'll prepare exactly the same. There'll be no, no reason why we wouldn't prepare professionally, do everything properly. It's a big game. You know, the crowd will be fully behind us. They were unbelievable tonight. I'm, I'm sure there was a really, you know, good attendance here. It seemed like it was busy. So we're going to need that support on Saturday because, you know, we are be playing a very, very good side. But one I look forward to, it's a challenge. Uh, they're a full-time side, you know, and we'll, we'll be excitable on, on, on Saturday and I'm really positive that we'll get a good outcome. Cheers, Angelo. Thank you, guys.